that's cool. Like, that's the thing. People always ask me, like, should I play major junior or, like, should I go, you know, the college route or whatever? It's like, first of all, I'm probably the wrong guy to be asking. But you can still go play major junior and then go back and play, go to school. Like, the, yeah, like the team here in Saskatchewan, like the U of S team here, stacked. Like, it's some of the yep. best hockey in the country. It's just all Western guys, five-year Western guys that want to now take that schooling that's paid for, get an education, and keep playing hockey. It's unbelievable yeah. hockey. 100% dude I think if I was Canadian I think if I was Canadian I would have done CIS like uh, because it's because you can get your schooling it's so much fun from what I've heard like everybody yeah. that I've talked to has said it's a great time you're still getting to play and you get that education and it's all paid for and I think even some of the guys that I was with are you kind of get money on the side right because you get something you get it all paid for and then mm -hmm. you get some so you're still making a little bit of money to like live off of uh, the only reason I didn't do that was just I was I think I was done being away from my family for I sure. was done being away from home for so long and then so so being in the coast I got to go play in Ontario which was closer and then I just kind of followed that that kind of path a little bit but I think CIS is I mean that's a great option if I was Canadian I would have considered it for sure yeah I played one year pro and then I came home and all my buddies I played junior A so I never played West in the Western League but all my buddy a lot of my buddies played in the Western League they were going to the U of S. I lived with my best friend who was playing on the team. So I'm like, I want to go to school. I want to play for the University of Saskatchewan. And so oh, okay. I, I couldn't actually play because I played a year pro. I had to sit out a year. I had a yep. red shirt, quote unquote. But I talked about this last podcast. I don't even think I was good enough to make that team. It was so stacked anyways. But I still hung out with those guys all year. And I practiced with those guys all year. And I'll tell you. Oh, was, no way. It was a lot of fun. Yeah, <laughs> it was unreal. a lot of fun. So I lived oh, the I'm life sure without is. living the life. There was no real pressure. And. I dusted off six grand to go to school because I had nothing paid for, but I was just like, whatever, let's go to school for a year. And I yeah. learned, like, just like my mom said, I'm not the best student. And I learned the hard way, but I had fun <laughs> and I got no regrets. And, uh, yeah, it was Dude, awesome. I'm the same way. I couldn't have, I probably couldn't have honestly gone to school if I wanted to because if I'm not interested, like, really interested in the subject, there's no way I'm really, yeah. like, paying attention to it. Well, it's tough, but too, because those guys are all living the life, right? But everything they got is paid for and they're being paid. And I'm grinding yeah. it out on the weekends playing senior hockey for a buck fifty a game, trying to get my rent covered. You know what I mean? Everyone's so, like, "Let's go do this, let's go do this." I'm just like, "Fuck, dude!" Like, yeah, absolutely. To yeah, that's a little different. See, I, I, I couldn't have. I don't think I could have done that.